Good morning everybody. Uh, this is Chris at Classic Cars of Palm Beach. We're going to be doing a walk around video on this 2020 uh, 6.2 liter Silverado RST. Uh, we do these videos for out of state and out of town buyers uh, to let them know exactly what kind of condition the vehicle's in before they receive it. Uh, we do a lot of out of state deals uh, where we just ship the cars and nobody, and, you know, obviously the people don't see them before they receive them. And uh, we don't like surprises for them, just like they don't. So uh, we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and do this video and point out any kind of nicks, scratches, dings, dents, curb rash on the wheels, any excess wear and tear on the interior, uh, all that kind of stuff, so that you know what it's gonna be like when you receive it. All right. Uh, we're gonna start out here on the passenger side front, kind of walking around, see a couple little nicks, and that is not nicks, that's just dirt. Let's look at this wheel over here. The wheel looks good. Curb rash. Tire tread is good. Let's see. All right, we're gonna come down the passenger side here. Got the running boards. See all these little nicks sometimes, that's just dirt. That's a little hairline scratch, but rub your finger over it and it kind of goes away. Maybe a little nick there. Not sure if that'll come out when we buff it or not, but it's very minor. Okay, these little spots here on the side. Are these dirt? Yeah, dirt. Headlights are, I mean, tail lights are real clear. Bumper's in great shape. I don't see any damage on the bumper. A lot of times on pickup trucks, that's where you see some damage. Okay, the tailgate's really nice. Don't see any damage there. Bed's got a spray in, looks real good. I, mean, I don't see any uh, stains or anything like that in this bed. So this thing's in really good shape. It's got the rear sliding window there. Okay, come around the driver's side. Come up on it. See this tire? Tire's got good tread left on it. Okay, rear wheel's good. I don't see any curb rash. That's just dirt on the gas cap. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's just dirt. Side of the car is in real nice shape. So I haven't seen any dents or damage on this car anywhere yet. Let's look at the front driver's side wheel. Don't see any curb rash. And there again, the tire's in great shape. Doesn't look like you're gonna have to do anything to this truck at all. It's just those are just a couple of dirt spots on there. Okay. The front these might be little nicks. On the uh, some of those are coming out. A couple of them are. These are pin, not, not even pin head size. They're like little, like pin nicks, like from stone chips. A few of them across the front. So to make it perfect, you'd have to spray that front bumper. Very simple to do. But uh, all there's on there is just little pin tip size nicks, you know, from stone chips. But uh, yeah, no damage on the vehicle at all on the outside. All right, let's go check the inside out. What we're going to look for on the inside is, you know, excess wear and tear, like where your arm is, your arm rest, and where you get in and out of the seats. That's where most of your damage is on a late model car, if there is any. Okay, this all looks really clean and nice. Okay, your seat's in excellent shape. Nice. I'm looking up at the headliner. It's going to be hard for you to kind of see in the in the video, but the headliner is perfect condition. There's no soil stains or anything on it. It's in great shape back seat. So I mean, it's 2020, so it should be in great shape. Uh, yeah, there's no nothing in the dash, nothing in the uh, like all the glass and everything is clear. So uh, nothing you have to do to this vehicle uh, to make it perfect, except for maybe if you wanted any of those little teeny nicks on the front bumper uh, taken care of, you'd have to paint. The front bumper, but uh, that's easy stuff. Somebody will charge you 125 bucks to do that. Uh, let me look at the back seat. Actually, I didn't look at that yet. Make sure I don't see any surprises there. Yeah, it's got the nice floor mats also in here. Nice rubber floor mats. So there you go. If I didn't cover something you uh, want to know about, just call us up, man. We'll be happy to get it for you. Thanks for watching.